Hey everybody, welcome back to Market Movers. I'm your host, Jason Yoss. I'm here with Michelle Kolker of Team Kolker with Compass. Michelle, how are you doing? I'm great, how are you? I'm doing excellent, thanks for being on with me. So one of the main questions we're getting right now is from our audience is prospecting. What are you doing that works and what are you not doing because it's not working or are you just not comfortable with it? Michelle, talk to me a little bit about your prospecting strategy. What's working for you guys? I'm a firm believer that what you're passionate about is going to be what you're you know, what you're gonna talk about best. Perfect. I'm not a cold caller, I'm not a door knocker. Got it. Someone on our team, Heather on our team, is a great door knocker. Great. Um, but I'm passionate about my community. I'm gonna naturally talk about it and be around it. A lot of our business is sphere-based. Got it. And it's also a sphere of influence-based people we know. Right. And then it's also based on, we have some specialties within our team. We get a lot of information out there via video and blog. So we'll have people reach out to us um, from that. Okay, so yeah. when you're put, you're putting out a lot of information and are you using social media or using email, like what's the best way you tend to get your information out? We have an awesome social media coordinator and we just give her the content and she gets it out, you know, Instagram and even TikTok and Facebook and nice. email and blog and, you know, different age groups are going to be drawn to different, you know, portals or whatever you want to call them. You so are correct. Yeah. So when you're meeting with these clients, what kind of information are they really asking? Like what are some key analytic type questions that they're saying, Michelle, I need to know about this. Yeah. So um, one in we're in 9127 in the Poway Unified School District. Got it. People come there for schools if right, they're right. families with kids. So we have a lot of information about schools. Then we get a lot of 55 plus clients and so we'll talk to them about the different options in our area and outside. Um, we get a lot of investment clients. Heather is an, esp uh, an, an expert in investing. Got it. So um, it kind of depends right. yeah, what, what they're looking what for. The subject matter. Talk to me about schools because, you know, this is one of the biggest thing I hear, especially 92127. Like, you're in Poway. What school are you going to? Are you getting into Del Norte? I think there's some new schools that are coming up over there. You got to know a lot more about that. Tell me about that, about that situation. Yeah, our schools are fantastic. There are a couple of high schools in 92127. The one that I focus on the most is Del Norte High School. It Got is it. fantastic. Then there is one elementary school, Oak Valley. Okay. I'm sorry, one uh, middle school, Oak Valley. And then there are several, many uh, elementary schools. Got so it. people, and then there's a school of choice called Design 39 Campus. Design 39 yes. Campus. Well, that sounds crazy. Tell me what Design 39, what's that all about? So it was the 39th school in the okay. in the Poway and last in the Poway Unified School District. Got it. And the superintendent really gave the, the creator at the time you know, full um, authority just to, to go out of the box. Really? And so they went for two years around to different schools all over the country, and mm -hmm. they kind of took what they thought would be the best model of um, the type of learning that you need for the jobs of the future, and right. we don't even know what those jobs that's, are. That's very true. That's awesome. So when it comes to schools, when it comes to specifically 92127, you said 55 and older. We talked about schools. What kind of information do you need to know? How did you find that kind of stuff out in order to be able to relay that to your client? Uh, I use, well, I am an attorney, and so I kind of have that right. analytical background. Um, and so if someone has a question, I answer it how I would want to receive the answer. Right. And a lot of it is um, curiosity. I am right. I think I was meant to be like a um, some type of reporter because I feel like I'm <laughs> constantly going out, and I like discovering information that others might not have. Nice. A long time ago when Design 39 Campus first opened, we got a phone call saying, I want to go there, and right. where do I need to live? Okay. And it was okay. like, no problem, I'll get that information to you. Right. It didn't exist. So we went out and spent a really? lot of time researching and created some, you know, some boundary maps. A traditional school just has boundaries. Right. This one goes by tax district. So, really? So basically, we, um, yeah, there's, there'll be a, you know, I love, I'm very drawn to new construction, um, and I've had experience through the years in 9227 doing new construction, and so as these things unfold we get people information about them i love it michelle that is such great information i know everybody out there really needs to know that kind of stuff especially in the 92127 thank you so much for joining me today i really appreciate it everybody thanks so much tune in next time to market movers